everybody. Happy Vlogmas Day 2. Uh, I'm just going to show you real quick three of my um, prized possessions. They're related. And uh, they were all gifts from my mom and AJ. So first up is Amazing Spider-Man number 14. And this is from... July of 1964 and why is it important it's the first appearance of the Green Goblin by Norman Osborn and the first meeting of the Hulk and Spider-Man and here's the Hulk on the cover and there's the Green Goblin on his original glider look at his pink purse and his thing that looks like a broomstick and there's the enforcers Um, the noise in the background is AJ messing with, uh, medication. So, um, but yeah, look at that. 12 cent goodness. And it's a 3.0, so it's not great. Um, and it doesn't have white or off-white pages. But, I mean, a 3.0 in its, in its whole, you know, it's whole. Um, it doesn't ha it's not, uh... Like, there's no pages missing or anything. And it's a Stanley story. Steve Ditko cover and art. And there's the that cool back that a lot of people remember. So that's Amazing Spider-Man, number 14. And then um, we go into... Of course, they're not in order. Sorry about that, everybody. We go to Amazing Spider-Man 121 from June of 1973. And this is important because this is the death of Gwen Stacy. Notice what name is not on there. Stan Lee was out of the country and they did this without him and he was mad. This is a 7.0. And they tell you, who, who, who's it going to be? Who's going to die? Who's going to die? And it ends up being Gwen. And the Green Goblin helps kill her. And look at that classic ad on the back. Isn't that neat? I never did send any money in to do any of these, but how cool. Sell some seeds. Get, get archery equipment, or a flying model, or a chemistry set. <laughs> and testimonials from people who have sold seeds. Love those old, those classic ads. And look at that classic cover. Who did the cover? John Ramita. Doesn't say senior or junior, but I'm guessing junior. Okay. And then, the bookend. Amazing Spider-Man 122. Look at that. Wrong, Goblin. You murdered the only girl I'll ever love. And today's the day you're going to die. And this is from July of 1973. And this is important because it is the death of the Norman Osborn Green Goblin. And again, no Stan Lee. And this is 7.0, off-white to white pages. These last two are in really good condition. Of course, they're nine years uh, newer. But look, there's the difference. Look at the look at the difference in the glider. Now he's riding the glider that a lot of us know. Not that broomstick thing. And his purse is orange, not pink anymore. So it's kind of neat to see the difference between or in how he how he did his thing. And on the back, look who's smiling now. Because he went to LaSalle Extension University. All right, I'm going to get my my college degree from the back of a comic book. You know it. Maybe people did, who knows. But that's Vlogmas Day 2. See you tomorrow for something else.